Despite the Warriors' close call against Louisiana Tech, two of Hawaii's seniors received whack honors. Liz Chun has complete coverage as she joins us from the road. Thanks, Mike. Well, we remain on the road with the UH football team. We are now in Houston, Texas, where the Warriors are practicing at Rice University. And coming off of last week's victory at La Tech, Hawaii has scored two WAC Player of the Week honors. Colt Brennan was named Offensive Player of the Week, and the award for special teams went to Dan Kelly. For the second week in a row, Colt Brennan has been voted the best in the WAC for offense. While the Heisman candidate is honored, he hopes his teammates aren't being overlooked. Just like because of the way the offense is and the talent I have around us, I get a lot of credit and a lot of recognition. I can guarantee there was a couple receivers out there that probably deserved it this week that played unbelievable games. Ryan and Devon and even Jason Rivers. His receivers certainly had their hands full. Brennan threw for 548 yards and set a school record with 43 completions. He had a total of 60 passes, which he says in no way tired him out. In practice, I'm throwing the ball, you know, 40, 400, 300, who knows how much I'm throwing it, but I'm throwing it just so many times. Dan Kelly took the WAC Special Teams Player of the Week award for his 49-yard field goal that tied the game with La Tech and sent it to overtime. I, I, I'm not really pleased with my performance at all. Uh, I'm honored that they recognized me. Um, I'm always honored, but it's you know, something that um, I've always been taught to, you know, it's nice, put it on the wall, forget about it until offseason, you can look at it later. While Kelly was clutch and a perfect six for six at the extra points, his blocked and missed field goals are what bother him most. A lot of things got to get fixed. Uh, my second field goal was absolute garbage. I'm, I was embarrassed by it. So it's one of those things where I just got to fix it myself. It's, it has nothing to do with any of the snaps, any of the holds. I mean, those are all perfect. It's all on me now. Two more awards to watch for for Brennan. He is up for the AT&T National Player of the Week Award, which he won last week with 45% of the vote. That comes from the fans via their text messaging, so I guess you can start dialing away. It will be announced on Thursday. The other national award he's up for is Rivals.com National Player of the Week. That will be announced on Wednesday. Reporting from Houston, Texas, Liz Chun, back to you.